Hey guys, in today's video, we're having a market analysis on V10S index price action. Basically, you guys know a price action trader, so I approach the market using a price action approach. So, here on this index, you can see this index has been bearish for four days straight. We got the first bearish day here at this point. The sells here, it sells, it sells, it sells. So, this index has been bearish for days now for four days straight. Would say so. What was next on this index? I would expect this bearish continuation. I would expect a reversal back to the offside. Looking to all of that into this, we'll be having a top down analysis on this index. So, coming to the weekly time frame, which is a higher time frame, as so always, say, whenever I want to analyze the market stuff on the higher time frame, it can be the monthly time frame, it can be the weekly time frame, it can be the daily time frame. But preferably, I start from the weekly time frame whenever I want to analyze the market so I can see the bigger picture of the markets, the bigger picture of the charts. So, right now on this index, we got the highs and lows, we got the highs at this point and got the lows at this point so right now you can tell that this index is reacting on these highs the sales are getting at this point is a result of market reaction on this key resistance level because you can tell that we got past market reaction on this level as a resistance resistance first at this point the sales it on side resistance here let's identify this properly the first reaction this level is resistance we got the sales it on side the second reaction here because the sales to downside the third reaction at this point we got it sells to downside the fourth reaction at this zone the sales to downside the fifth reaction here the sales to downside and sixth reaction at this point the sales to the downside so you can easily predict the sales at this point by saying that if price can sell from here the first time sell from here the second time sell from here the third time is likely to sell the fourth time, the fifth time possibly, and now the sixth time, which we are getting at this point. So, what do we expect of this index? How do you expect a continuation of these sales to this key support level? Because we got a support level at this point. You can see that price bought on this level a couple of times. We got a couple of market reaction on this level as a support. The first reaction on this zone, a support here. The second reaction at this point, a support right. The third reaction, a support. The fourth. A support at this zone, the support at this point, the support at this level. We got a couple of reactions on this level as a support and as a resistance. So, likely to get price sell further to this level is the possibility of price selling to this key support level we got at this zone. So, when we identify this level, let's have this level as a level that are looking up to price to get to. Right? So, coming to the daily time frame on this index after spotting the market structure on the weekly time frame we can tell that we got this index being an uptrend previously we can see this market was in an uptrend previously on the daily time frame creating higher highs and higher lows heading to the upside and there was a break of trend on this index which is clearly seen at this point right there was a break of trend at this zone before this break of trend we got a reversal pattern formation a bearish reversal pattern formation price created this head and shoulders pattern right we got the left shoulder here we got the head at this zone Right, and we got the right shoulder at this point. So you can see that this reversal pattern formation, this head and shoulders pattern formation, we got at this point initiated the sales. And we got a key level of resistance which turned support now broken turn resistance at this point. This was a level of resistance here, resistance at this zone. It got broken above, tested as a support at the buy to the upside, support at this zone. So it got broken at this point and we got the sales to the downside. So we have another level as well which you have to watch out for a level of support a key level of support basically so we're expecting price to sell to this level for the buys in the coming days and hours on this index if you can get price sell to this identified key level of support right which we got already at this point we're likely to get price buy up to test this reversal pattern formation because on every reversal pattern we got the neckline so this is the neckline of this head and shoulders pattern right so if price can buy to this level if price can buy to this level we're getting more sales on this index so the buys expected basically on 10 s index in the coming days and hours for the sales the buys expected to get the sales on this index so let's look out for short-term buy opportunity on 10 s index to this level this would be our target level so coming to the fourth time how to approach this index we have to look out for a faster pattern formation on this level to buy this index because you can see that this index has been bearish for days now and you can see that the bears are exhausting their selling power they need to gather up momentum to short this index more. In order to gather up momentum, the bulls have to come into the market to push the market to push price to the offer a little bit to come test this key level so you can get the sales on it. So the forward time frame is looking good as well. If you can get a good reversal pattern formation on the lower time frame, 
like the one hour time frame right or the 15 minute time frame we'll be buying this index so we're getting a good pattern formation we got the descending channel prices created at this one so let's watch closer on this descending channel if price can break out of the descending channel we'll be buying this index right we can get a clear break of this descending channel we we'll buying this index to the upside so that's my view and market analysis on this index our entry level would be at this zone our entry level would be at this level if price can break above this descending channel which is also reversal pattern formation break out of this key level we got at this on this lower time frame key level right it's clearly seen on the 15 minute time frame if price can break above this level we're buying this index so that's my view and market analysis on v10 s index price action basically we're having our first tp level at this zone we're having our first tp level if i to take these buys our first tp level will be at this point right and our second tp level will be at this zone then our last tp level will be at this identified key level which is our target level this point we're expecting price to buy to this neckline the neckline of this reversal pattern formation that would be our last target level on this index so smile like button for market analysis like this and drop a good comment on this video don't forget to subscribe if you're new to the channel to my tiny viewers i appreciate the support for engaging my videos it really means a lot guys let's do more and have enough day.